giving you an opportunity to get the full story from the people who tell it best. This is Mediacom News Leaders. Welcome to News Leaders. Glad you could join us today for local news from all over the place. So stay tuned for some great people you're going to be meeting, like this guy over here. Dave Para, welcome back to News Leaders. Good to see you. Good to see you, James, always. Uh, I would just want to say, last time we talked, um, uh, it was quite a while ago, but on this segment, mm -hmm. um, since then, your wife, Kathy, passed away. Right, in, uh, in April. Yeah. April of 2019. Mm -hmm. And I know it's been quite a journey for you, but I was thinking yes. this morning, you two played together for so many years, 40... 44, I'm thinking. 44 years of playing music side by side. Mm -hmm. The music, of course, lives on. Yes. And, and you're carrying on with the music too, right? Sure. Uh, music still is a great solace and a source of inspiration for me. But, uh, you know, yeah, so I can continue to play. But when you've played and sung with somebody like that for so long, it uh, really becomes um, a part of you. And, um, you know, it's, we became, it was so easy and wonderful to play with Kathy and sing. So. Yeah. Well, many of us miss her, but yeah. we've got recordings of her too, sure. video, audio, and she'll live on in that respect too. Yeah, um, and I talk to her most of the time. <laughs> I'm glad she's. I'm yeah. just glad to hear from you. Yeah. Um, yes. But this led you on to a different venue in your music, and uh, well, it was the same venue. We um, we one of our dearest things to do was to play for riverboats, uh, and we've done we did that since uh, the mid '90s. And uh, I still was able to go back to the river last year, and I uh, will this year, uh, uh, with friends. And uh, I have another gig that seems to be happening. So, um, but I was able to do the dates uh, that we had been contracted for with some friends. Uh, not the, you know, I couldn't do it with one person because not everybody could do them all. But uh, I did them with three different friends. So. I had to rework music three different ways, but one of those was Paul Foch here in Columbia, and um, uh, it was I've known Paul for as, almost as long as I've known Kathy, maybe just as long. So uh, it was uh, fun to do that. It was, yeah, you know. So that leads to what we're talking about then for <laughs> February. You've got a date coming up at the Columbia Public Library. So Paul and I are going to play do a concert at the Columbia Public Library. Kathy and I did concerts there. I know Paul has. Um, and uh, so it'll be nice to return there. Um, Paul uh, and, and I did songs about the Civil War and, you know, we recorded that Lewis and Clark album together back. One of my um, favorites. I was, love that album. It was a great time to do that. So, um, uh, we're going to feature river songs at that concert, so a lot of songs that local people would know and recognize, but uh, we'll do that, and um, it's been fun working with Paul, it surely has. He's a good companion and, um, and, a, and a great musician. So, so Dave Parra, Paul Foch, February the 10th? February 10th. It's a Monday. Get out there. But it's a free event. It's free at 7 o'clock. 7 o'clock. At the friend's room there. What, about an hour, I suppose? Yeah, it's about an hour is about it. So yeah. everyone's invited. Oh, sure. Come along, bring the kids, bring Grandma and Grandpa <laughs> for River yeah. Songs. Um, and it uh, should be a really interesting evening. I hope so. It should be fun. And, and uh, you know, the river is a big, important thing in our lives. And, and ha you know, and um, it's kind of a definition of who we are musically in this region. Yeah, and you and Kathy did such a great job of promoting River Songs, too. My goodness, the albums are just full. Um, I've got uh, dbrl.org. That's the website for the library for more mm -hmm. information. Or what, what is yours? Well, mine is still bartonpara.com. Um, I'm uh, and it's still active. I, I've I can I have a calendar for the things I do there. I also play with a couple of other bands. Uh, uh, Kathy and I played with our two friends Mike and Tinley in a group we called Snorty Horse. And uh, we'll, we're playing um, in January 17th uh, at the Columbia, the Mid-Missouri Country Dancers there at, at the Peachtree uh, Center. Ballroom Academy of Columbia, yeah, the Peachtree right. Center, that's on January the 17th? Uh, they do dances twice a month uh, on Fridays. It's, a great, it's been a great source of music for us. Dave Parra and Snorty Horse. Yeah, Snorty Horse, yeah. Gotta love that title. <laughs>
All right, Dave. Well, you're in our thoughts and our prayers and our condolences, Thank too. Thank you, James. Thank and, you. And uh, I hope you come back and see me more on News Leaders. I will. 2020. Thank We're here for you. All right. Dave Parrott, thank you so much. <laughs>